Gajnabi was one of the standout players in the Guyana Cricket Board's Intercounty 50 over and T20 tournaments, which were used to select the Guyana team. The Barbician was the most valuable player of the 50 over tournament, picking up five wickets and scoring 173 runs, including a magnificent 129. Her efforts led Barbies to the double as the ancient county females won both competitions. Okay, you had a pretty good um, inter-county tournament coming into this one here. Um, tell us a bit of some of the work you did to perform so well in that tournament. Um, first, I must say um, I did a lot of work on my fitness and I think I see the hard work pays off. That hard work is continuing in the Guyana camp leading up to the regional tournament under the watchful eyes of coach Julian Moore. At 21, Gajnabi is still young in her development, but her rapid rise in the sport has made her a frontline player for Guyana. Much is expected of the right-handed all-rounder who has represented the West Indies in 10 one-day internationals and seven T20s. Looking with the bat, um, I think that I have the ability, the, po the potential to score runs. So I think that is one thing, that is the most important thing. That is one of my role right now in the Guyana team, is to stay and bat and look to score some runs. Gajnabi lauded the camaraderie in the camp noting that the senior players have been guiding the new ones along. Don't put pressure on yourself. Um, I think that we have a lot of senior players around and they will support like as they usually do support the younger players. And I think that is something that is the main thing when a younger player comes into the team. And on the prospects of playing at home, Gajnabi had this to say. I think there is no pressure because I think that is our home turf. I think we understand the conditions and that is something that you know, will help us to achieve and to win this tournament. The Guyanese will open their campaign in the 50-over segment against defending champions Barbados on June 7th at the National Stadium Providence. The other two venues that will host matches are the Everest and Enmore Grounds. The squad reads Shemaine Campbell captain, Shabika Gajnabi vice-captain, Cherry Ann Fraser, Katana mentor, Sharika Campbell, Shanata Grimmond, Flaffiana Millington, Kezia Schultz, Tremaine Smart, Irva Giddings, Mandy Mangru, Kumari Pasod, Ashmini Munisar and Lushana Tassant. The reserves are Hima Singh, Diane Prahalad, Leticia Jordan and Nafisa Sabar. Reporting for Newsroom, I'm Avanash Ramzan.